This is a specimen of an aspen tree, Populus tremula, growing in the grounds of spears near Beeth. This tree is a member of the poplar family. What's unusual about it is that it has leaves that have a petiole or stalk that is bilaterally flattened. So rather like holding a piece of paper, it moves very easily in the slightest bit of wind. And the reason for that is that this plant is easily damaged by bright sunlight, as are others. That causes necrosis, that is, death of parts of the leaf surface or lamina. And the movement of these leaves is designed to get over that by shifting back and forth in the slightest breeze, then bright sunlight is not always directed straight onto the surface. Another side effect is that the lower leaves of a larger tree will get some of the sunlight passed towards them when the leaves above are moving. Another feature of aspen is that they are clonal plants. They do produce flowers and seeds, but they frequently spread by underground runners, underground stems, that will then push above the surface to form a new tree. And that will continue over a large area. But it's argued that one of the largest living things on Earth is a single clone of aspen trees that grows in North America. Because of this uh, movement of the leaves, when there appears to be no wind, the tree has picked up a bad reputation in terms of uh, folklore, because they believe that that rustling sound of the leaves touching each other was actually the tree spirits, which might be malignant or, or might be friendly. This is the only sample of this particular tree growing at Spears old school grounds and it is expected it will eventually take over an area here as a single clone. Not a very common tree in Ayrshire. There are only a, a few natural sites, although a great deal of planting has been taking place of late.